Sagittarius. Okay. I just said Scorpio. I'm a Scorp, Sag, perfect cusp rising. So, and I really liked what came up for Scorpio. <laughs> so let's see what comes up for you. So I just shuffled, cut the deck. Oh, Hermit on the bottom. Okay. Devil on the top. Capricorn. Virgo. Going deep within. Okay. Facing all the darkness, all the demons. Collapsing. All those lies. All the fear that's lies. Okay, so that you can come out and reveal your radiance. All the things that you discovered within. All right, Sag. Sage, okay. <laughs> right. Let's see what just flows out. We'll do. Oh, please don't stick. Let's get through this whole reading. Please, 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 please. I don't know if this is going to... Maybe if I unplug it. So... Is it okay? Is it going? Am I going too fast for you? <laughs> I feel like it's the, uh, um, oh, what's that movie? Master of Disguise. Okay, what well, flipped over? We got something here. We got a nugget here. What do we got here? Oh, we have the star card. Sagittarius. <gasps> Get it started. Oh. O, right? The O gets it started. So, the visionary, the quest, the path, the destiny, the fate. So, we'll keep that. That flipped around, so that was destined to be yours. Clandestine, your clan, your spirit family, so your star family, I'm getting your star family is coming in, Sag. They're coming in for landing. <laughs> what else you got for us, team of benevolence, the ones who love us and we love you? Oh, okay, so Five of Cups. I came up for Scorpio, too. So this is some walking away so that you can follow your destiny, okay? So two upright cups behind you, so don't look at the past and all the stuff. that is gone, baby, gone, baby, gone. Okay, turn around. Your destiny awaits. Ace of Rods, brand new beginning. Eight of Cups, but you gotta, you gotta walk away. Okay, just, and you can walk away with love. See how they're all nicely stacked up and stuff. You don't have to kick them all over and throw a big tantrum about it. Just move towards your dreams, your bliss. Follow your bliss. That's the star card with the five of cups. It's like not following your bliss or following your bliss. <laughs> something you can do something about or something you can't do anything about. So... Let's do the thing that we can do something about. So, Sag, what do we? What else do we have for you for April? What's in the cards for you for this month? I, as, hey, man, I think it's just like Sag. You're free, baby. Go, follow your bliss. Go, run, but up, but up. Get out of here. Go shoot those love arrows. Okay. <laughs> that's what I'm saying get out of here go shoot those love arrows okay get out into the world now so you went into that cave that hermit okay there it is again came out now we have the moon card on the bottom we'll check the top card so the hearth the heart the home the earth so now getting out into the world okay and showing everybody else what you learned when you went deep into your heart okay this nine of wands is like oh that's the ten of rods oh no that's good okay i was gonna say man 
Why is the nine of rods with there with these two cards? Because that's a beautiful. So ten of rods. That's what I'm saying. Okay, the pressure's off. You're done. You come out the cave. Ten of rods. Boom, boom. Throw it down. Look at all the lessons. I got ten. One for each of you. <laughs> Let's build with all this knowledge I have to share. Sage, Sag, okay. And look at that fire, okay? Four of rods, ten of rods, that's a lot of fire. And stars, I mean, hello. The hot, baby. Hot, hot, hot. So moon, okay. Sacral chakra, divine feminine, the womb. Okay, also, this is like the fortress of the heart, the protective layer of the heart, the four of pentacles. So once we heal, a lot of, you know, all the, sa all the pain is in the sacral chakra, and a lot of our healing ha is, has to do with the sacral. Okay, so, and that's where, that's our deity chakra. So when we clear all that out, we can get in tune with all the magic. We can stay in our heart, follow our bliss, trust in our divine guidance because we're totally, fully surrendered. Okay, no fear. So this is un unlocking the heart because we have four of pentacles. And here's the four of rods. Okay, so, um... If you aren't experiencing it in your current 3D reality, you are moving towards it, okay? And you're being assisted. Because Major Arcana, the Hermit, and Star Card, okay, you're being assisted by God to share this. So you may not have, like, a physical, tangible partner, but you can still share what you know about that with the world, okay? Okay. As you're following your path, you're sharing. This one, let's see here. Yeah, because I wanted, for some reason, I wanted to look behind that. So there's the Empress, that love, okay? So that's the, that four of pentacles blocking your heart. Nope. So maybe some sacral chakra healing happening when you're doing the hermit mode. So when you can come out, when you come out and share with the world what you learned you you show by example by following your bliss and your your life path okay yeah going going deep within the moon the womb the hermit card four of wands the heart the earth star start heart earth okay um and for some of you, it might be difficult because you are seemingly doing this alone, okay? But you don't. You have your angels. You have your team, okay? So as you follow your divine guidance, that leads you to your partner. So you still, we still have to do our mission work, so to say, okay? Yeah. But we're all meant to have a partner down here, but that's not, that's not the goal. That's not the... We stay stagnant. We don't move anywhere when we stay fixated on one thing. Okay? Just just have that one thing, that focus be God, and then I think you'll be fine. <laughs> Everything else will align just fine. So when we get focused on the wrong thing, we think we're being focused, but it's really a distraction. Okay, what do we have here? See? Nine of Swords. So you think you're being focused maybe on something, but it's really not part of your divine path. And so really it's disguised. It's really a distraction. It's, it's a focal point distortion. It's not where you sh the direction in which you should be looking. Okay, you need to focus on your path, star card. Okay, let your divine guidance guide you, the star, the north star guide you, okay? Guide your ship home to the heart where we speak to God. <laughs> Judgment card, Archangel Gabriel. The call of the heart, Knight of Cups. Heeding that call of the heart and moving in love. Saggy, saggy pants, okay. <laughs>
Yeah, I knew these, la the last one, Scorpio, and this one I was going to really resonate with. Let's see what else we got here. Round it out. Round the bend. It's just around the bend I got. So, okay. So I'm saying you got to release the hold on your heart and just be open so that you can continue on your path and not stay stagnant. And because what I'm getting is like, because the hermit's kind of like the sage doing it alone. They don't really, their, their partners are in spirit. Okay. And you know, we have one eventually, maybe it's in the hereafter. But don't let that stop you from moving forward <clears throat> on your path. you got to release that hold on your heart. Yeah, there's that four of pentacles. It shot out. But look, see what's awaiting when you do that? When you just trust instead of worrying about not having... Everything is divine. When, where, who, all of it is divine. So we have to just trust in God. That ten of cups is for everyone. But the only way to get there is to trust in God and surrender and submit to our divine will. Okay, our higher self. Page of Swords. So that's the perspective. New, refreshed perspective. You have this information. What are you going to do with it? You want that Ten of Cups, right? <laughs> Didn't we start out with the with the hermit and the devil card? So you want that ten of cups? So you gotta face your fears. What is it? What's holding you back? Because this is awaiting you. So maybe that's the thing you're afraid of. So it's up to you what you do with this information. This is very much I get Gemini energy energy whenever I Whenever I see the Page of Swords, you can go black with it or go white with it. Just like that devil card, okay? What are you going to do with this information? Sage, Hermit, Sag. Can't keep it to yourself. You have to share it with the world. And that's part of your divine destiny and your path. And as you do that, you will see the pot of gold at the end of the rainbow. And see how it makes like a heart shape in the white? Okay. Pure, true love of spirit. So you let, if you're led by the spirit, you let the spirit lead you, the star card. Then that leads you to your spirit partner. Your divine breath, complement, the wings, the lungs. Okay. All right, Sagittarius. There's your reading for April. I hope that helped. Love, peace, and blessings to you all. I'll find my little arrow here so we can shut her on down. All right. Have a good April, you guys. See you next time.